Hi everyone, John Paul Brionis here from InMotion Hosting and thank you for joining us for another video in our Getting Started series. Today we're going to show you how to increase your email quota in cPanel. Alright, we're going to begin by logging into cPanel. So go ahead and log into your cPanel. Once you've logged in successfully, we're going to click the mail the, under the mail section, we're going to click email accounts. When you do that, you're going to see your email accounts listed here. If you have a lot of email accounts, there'll be several pages you can flip through. They'll be in alphabetical order. In my example here, you notice that this manager account is in red and it says that I'm using 8 megabytes of the 5 megabytes available. And keep in mind that this limitation is set when you created the email account. So 5 megabytes is really low, but I set it there just as an example to show you that it will turn red once it starts to exceed that amount. And in this case, I'm going to change my quota and I'm going to increase it to 250. So when you click the Change Quota button, it'll drop down and you'll see here Mailbox Quota and you can enter a different size in megabytes. As an example, I'm going to put 250, then click the Change Quota button. You'll see the quota was changed to 250 and now you'll see I'm in green and it's only showing that I'm using 8 megabytes of the allotted 250 megabytes. And so now, um, essentially the, the problem here is corrected. Um, but as another example, I'm going to show you, you can also set it to unlimited. So click the change quota button again, it'll drop down. I'm going to set it to unlimited and then I'm going to click the change quota button again. And now it's set to unlimited. You'll see there's an infinity sign there showing that it's been increased and that there's no limit. And essentially that's it. This mailbox quota has been increased. Um, also keep in mind that you can download the emails and remove them from the server using a pop a setup. For example, in Outlook or Thunderbird or Mac Mail, actually set that up as pop, which by default will remove the emails from the server, which would also correct this problem. Thank you for joining us for another video in our Getting Started series. Feel free to like this video and comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? It's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.